way to start the new year than becoming a woman. I feel like if you believe it, it can happen. Okay, not me being Tony Robbins over here. I'm gonna be a nurse. Uh, I'm hoping you guys can see. Girl, don't do me like that. I have a lot of New Year's resolutions, so there's gotta be one that I at least accomplish. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Hey, how are you? If you are new here, we are going to be doing dream boards because a girl needs to manifest. And I'm such a visualizer. Is that a word? I'm such a visualized person. Whatever. I need to see it. Look at me girl like okay also i'm wearing sweatpants because you know a girl is on her period and what better way to start the new year than becoming a woman so we are going to make dream boards today i kind of already put mine together but i have to like glue it I actually have no glue so we're gonna be using tape today which is fine but yeah i'm gonna see if you guys can so this is kind of what we're working with we're just gonna sit chit chat talk about new year's goals all these pictures are from Pinterest. I actually have a board on my Pinterest that literally says like 2023 goals. You guys need some like inspo, go to my Pinterest. I'll put it like right here. It's just my name. You guys will know because I have a profile picture and everything. So I didn't want it to be basic. I didn't want to put like the middle to be like 2023. So I actually did this. It says best year ever because I'm manifesting that. I have a lot of things that I want to do. I just really want to glow up this year. This is my year. I can feel it. So we're going to glue some things down. If you're not subscribed, babe. So like I told you guys, I have no glue. So I'm going to just use tape, which is kind of like crappy. But I'm going to use tape for now. Show you guys how I do it. So I want to talk about some New Year's goals. I feel like all of us kind of have a lot of the same goals. Just like getting better. But still, I want to share with you guys my New Year's resolution. So that like my board makes sense, you know. I don't even know where to start. Okay, so some big goals that I want this year is, first of all, I'm graduating nursing school. If you guys didn't know, I'm in school and I literally graduate in June. So it's January. So I literally have this little thing. It says future nurse. Look how cute. So obviously like that has to go on my board because that's what I'm going to be this year. I also want to, you know, gain a lot of subscribers on YouTube. That's been my goal for like, the past two years and we've started kind of a family around here i think i've hit 500 subscribers and i would love to get like monetized this year go to a thousand baby and grow our family so that is definitely something that you know i look forward to and something that i really am excited for this year i feel like honestly guys i'm gonna i'm gonna say i'm gonna manifest a hundred thousand subscribers because girl there's nowhere but up and i'm gonna put out there i'm gonna put out in the universe that i'm gonna get a hundred thousand subscribers so by the end of this year if you've already joined me girl we made it for now i'm just very pleased with like everyone who supports me so i'm very happy about that but yes that is one of my goals is to grow my channel make good content like i feel like sometimes i'm like i post every week and then like i don't so you better watch out for videos weekly because I am dedicated and this is something that I want. I love, I love making videos. It's literally so fun and I just get to like be with you guys. Now that I'm like almost done school, definitely two big goals that is like bringing me into adulthood, which is kind of scary, but is buying a home and owning my first car. Now I always use my parents' car. I don't have my own and that's just something that i really really look forward to this year i just really want to be independent and like feel good that i have all these things on my own and not like rely on my parents i feel like if you believe it it can happen okay not me being tony robbins over here this is my little mansion and then also you guys are gonna be like what the heck that's a mom car but i really want a kia soul <laughs> It's so funny because it's such a like basic car. Like I could be like, I want a Rolls Royce, you know, or I want a Mercedes. No girl, I want a Kia Soul. Kind of being still in the same goals is that I want to be like financially free. I feel like over the years of me buying a credit card, which was like somewhat dumb as hell. <laughs> yeah, owning a credit card was probably not the best idea because you just spend, spend, spend and you just like spend a lot of money and sometimes it's not even like worth it. So I feel like definitely a goal of mine is to 
you know, be better with my money. So I just want to be like financially free. I put like literally a little, I put it right here. I put it, say, it says financially free and then it actually has money. So more money. What, what do they say? Like something, something I attract. <laughs> that's literally what kind of quote is that? But, but that's what I plan to do is to attract money. So I'm going to put it on my board. <laughs> Next I have, I want to be a fashionista. <laughs> you guys are going to be like, okay, girl, brat stall over here, passion for fashion. I really, really want to like up my, you know, my um, outfit game. I know I look like I look like Kim K right now with my like cute sweatpants and my like skims top, even though this is like sheen top. So I have like some pictures over here. I'll probably like literally recap this whole thing at the end, but I'm just kind of going through it while I you know put the pictures down just have some pictures of like really cute outfits that like inspire me and like what i want to wear and yeah so living for that I literally wear sweatpants every single day of my life i have no sense of style i feel and constantly on my pinterest looking at like cute outfits and i'm like okay i want to be that bitch so that is just obviously one of my goals okay so let's move into like fitness i think that this year i'm gonna have my dream body <laughs> and i feel like people say that every year i am literally i'm determined you know what i mean like not me getting a little emo but like when you look at pictures of yourself and you're like wow all my friends look good and i don't it, it kind of like affects you in some type of way i never want to feel that way ever again so this year girl i'm changing it like why keep complaining and not changing it when you feel bad about yourself so i'm not saying that if you look a certain way you need to change it i just personally feel like i don't like the way i look right now i want to be healthy i want to be strong i want to look good and so that's why i'm going to do it that's my goals now that's not everybody's goals that's just my goals and i feel like everybody has different fitness goals too i feel like i want abs hello i don't want abs i want like a flat tummy like boute and i also want like leaner legs i feel like a lot of the times girls want the big juicy thighs which i love that but like for me i just i want you to think that i have no butt and then i turn around and i'm like mm, yeah that's right i just i feel like that's definitely one of my goals my like fitness goals this year I feel like I can work out probably like every single day, but my thing that's really hard for me is eating healthy. I love, I love a good ice cap. Pretend like you didn't see that. Obviously, like I, I'm not going to like restrict myself because that's how you fail. Hello. Have you not read a book? I do definitely want to, you know, just start eating healthy. And I feel like my problem is like, I don't like healthy foods. Okay. If it looks green girl back up, I don't want to eat it. I feel like I've been looking at so many new recipes and stuff lately that I'm like, okay, okay. I can, I can do something with this. Like my, one of my goals is definitely, um, making more recipes. I feel like that's, what's going to help me like start eating healthy. Right. Right. Let's move into the self care part of me. I feel like I need to establish a morning routine and a night routine. I was doing it for a while and I feel like I saw the best change in myself then because I don't know why I had like consistency. I had a routine. I was living lavish and I feel like that's just, that's just the key is to have a good morning routine and a good night routine. If you guys didn't know, I work a lot of night shifts. So I work 12 hour nights. So I work from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. And I always think like, oh, well, how can I have a night routine if I'm working nights? I told myself when I get off my shift and I get home, that's when you do your like night care skin routine. You're like read a book, do things like that, that like kind of make you happy or like things that are going to make you fall asleep. So that's the energy I'm putting out. Okay. I put always be kind. I feel like you can either say bad things about yourself, say bad things about others, gossip, and those things are all awful. You should not be doing those things. You don't want to put that negative energy out in the world. When you say awful things about yourself, doesn't that make you feel bad? You know what I mean? And do you want to make somebody else feel that way? Definitely my friend group likes to gossip. <laughs> and I think that's just something that I want to like stay away from i don't want to gossip as much as i do because obviously like gossiping is wrong you guys 
I just I'd want to be kinder to myself I want to be kinder to others I just I just think like girl you're not in high school why the hell are you talking shit about people or you know talking behind people's backs it's not right so that's definitely something that I want to improve it's just be kinder you know to myself and to other people so more of like my adventurous side i have a lot of new year's resolutions so there's got to be one that i at least accomplish my more adventurous side is definitely like going on more trips i want to go skiing this year i live in canada and hello i've never gone skiing in my entire life or snowboarding whatever and i just really want to go I also just want to do more like road trips and stuff with my friends. I also want to take more pictures. I feel like something that's always holding me back is that I always feel like I always want to take a lot of pictures, but because of the way I look, I never wanted to take pictures. Isn't that awful? When you, when you really think about it, like, oh, I don't want to create memories and have them forever because of the way I look. That is bad pussy energy. You know when boys have like small dick energy? I feel like equivalent is like bad pussy energy. So we don't want that. Like I'm just gonna take tons of pictures even on New Year's dude. Like right now I'm not in the way that I'm not in the um like physique I guess that I want or like what if my makeup looks like shit? What if my hair looks like shit? It's like who cares? At least you have those pictures and those memories to look back on, you know? I'm gonna take pictures wherever I am and whoever I'm with. I this is kind of like with the whole like um feeling good about myself and stuff is that I I'm going to love myself okay I'm going to look in the mirror every day and be like you are fucking stunning bitch I'm gonna say you are so sexy I feel like I have not really captivated like my inner sexy bitch and that is definitely definitely a goal of mine is that I want to be that bitch and another thing that i really really want to do this year i even have the word yes right here i want to say yes to more things i feel like i've always been kind of like oh like maybe i can't do that no i don't think i can do that girl why can't you like, i always feel that way because i'm in my comfort zone like get out of your comfort zone girl not caring about what other people think and starting and start caring about ourselves I am going to say yes to everything and anything because you never know who you might meet. It's all about who you know and what you do. And if you're constantly out, guess what? Things might come to you because you met someone at the right time. When you're constantly in your room doing nothing, I feel like, who are you going to meet, girl? Like, literally, who are you going to meet? No one. You literally have these big dreams and you're not doing anything about it. T. How do I phrase this? don't always say yes to everything when it puts yourself in danger i literally said to myself this is going to be the best year of my life because you are putting yourself out there you are going to do things that your other self probably always told you no no way no how <laughs> just know that it's going to be a good year if you guys tried this please let me know how your experience is i feel like personally i have really really amazing amazing friends like all my friends work nine to five that's their job so if i want to go for a walk or a hike on a wednesday morning or wednesday you know at 1 p.m i can't because all my friends are working or like a lot of my friends work nights too so they're sleeping i just really want to like open up to like doing bumble bff is that weird meeting new friends is kind of like a date and i don't know kind of cute please comment down below if you guys have done bumble bff because i'm so interested in it i like really want to try it out just like meet new people meet new friends and that's like again with my whole new year's resolution is putting myself out of my comfort zone because oh my god like meeting someone like first dates are scary <laughs> they're nervous they're like butterflies whatever and it's like i know some people who've like met really good people i feel like when you think about it like okay as someone who's been with their boyfriend since i was 17 i'm now 23 so like i haven't gone on a first date in a long time where some people who are single and their 20s live in life i feel like they go on a lot of dates and it's like really nerve-wracking and it's like but is it like fun you know i don't know how to explain it but i feel like 
you know, I feel like it would be like the same, like meeting a new friend, like being like, are we going to hit it off? Are we going to, you know, be like really good friends? I don't know. I just think of it in that sense. And I'm like, it's kind of like exciting. It's like kind of fun to like have new friends. Think that that would be like a really cool experience. Even if it was like a shitty, like experience, it's still like an experience, you know? So for the final look, here she is. Look. I'm hoping you guys can see oh. girl don't do me like that best year ever because I'm not like a basic bitch I don't put 2023 I put best year ever because this is gonna be the best year ever <laughs> oh my god I feel like I'm like doing a presentation living so this is what I was talking to you guys about I want to be more adventurous watch me manifest everything that I want okay um there's a girl taking pictures I told you guys I want to do more pictures there's a girl skiing saying yes to everything right going on little trips with my friends um this is kind of like traveling you know i feel like i'm not really going to travel much this year because i have so much going on this year like me graduating and just like i'm gonna buy a house i'm buying a house and i'm buying a car manifesting that in the universe so i just don't really have time to travel but next year girl i have like 10 that I'm gonna go on but anyways let's move on I did put some traveling cause just in case I felt sad and I wanted to do a little trip I don't know if you guys can see it but these I put a couple of little like outfits and stuff that like kind of inspire me to be more fashionista like so I put like two little cute outfits this is like my self-care portion this is like the ginger hair that I want. I'm actually gonna get my hair done in January. I'll show you guys. It's just gonna be like a lighter ginger. You know, this is very wintry ginger. We're gonna go light ginger, you know, summer ginger. We have like a bath. We have like this pretty girl doing like her self care. This girl doing her self care. Five minute journal, like all that. And then I also have this that probably can't see because it's really small, but it says always be kind. So I told you I'm gonna be more kind this year. This is my fitness healthy section. These are girls who kind of like the bodies I want. Also look at this picture. Like that bit, that, okay, really? Like that bitch is a bad bitch. I might do a tennis look next year and be like, hi booty, you know? So then I said recipes because I want to do more recipes. This girl's just like clean girl aesthetic in the veggie aisle. So that's me. <laughs> and then I wrote confidence because confidence is key, baby. And then I also have like pictures of like flat abs, a little booty with some, some little skinny thighs that I want, a little flat stomach. And up here is like my goals. So my dream car, my dream house, being financially free, having money. And up here we have like, just like a boss babe. She's just a boss babe. Just like a picture of like a really nice like scenery of like someone studying. So I just put it there. Um, getting good grades. We're manifesting good grades this year. Um, I'm going to be a future nurse. <laughs> I'm going to be a nurse. Uh, my 1,000, uh, is it 100? 100,000 um, subscriber plaque. And then here it's like, my current subscribers, 100,000. This is my dream board. I love it. So that's the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I do a lot more vlog style videos. If you're new to my channel, I actually do a lot more vlogs. I love doing vlogs. Like you guys, me and you just spending the day together. So this is kind of different. Just kind of more of a sit down. We're just going to, you know, do our goals for 2023. Comment down below what goals you guys have this year because... I just I just love like glowing up being better versions of ourselves if you guys like today's video give a thumbs up subscribe follow me on Instagram for more content and I'll see you guys in the next video I was gonna say in the next vlog but it's probably gonna be a vlog just this one is in. I'll see you guys in the next video mm -hmm.